Tesla will soon introduce new liquid cooling charging connectors that are going to transfer energy when you charge your Tesla faster and decrease charging times. How is going to happen? Because Tesla filed a new patent for a new liquid cooled charging connector for a vehicle that transfers energy faster and decreases charging times by better dissipating heat. Looks like a fast, simple and cool idea to have sleeves over the charging connectors which will liquidly cool the charging connector and therefore transfer energy faster and decrease charging times by better dissipating heat. So electrical vehicles and hybrids generally use electric power from a rechargeable battery as a power source, right? These rechargeable batteries must be recharged from another energy source. Recharging can occur at a charging station by connecting an energy supply to a vehicle's charging inlet through a cable with attached charging connector. To transfer energy faster and decrease charging times, the cable and charging connector must be capable of withstanding high current loads. Current charging connectors are limited in the current loads that they can support as their ability to dissipate heat is limited. Thus, there is a need for a new charging connector to solve the aforementioned problem. And here's what Tesla's new patent does. In the summary of the patent, which the link I will have in the description of this video, friends, it says the present disclosure, meaning the patent that is being disclosed by Tesla to the patent agency of new way of faster charging related to a new charging connector. The charging connector has a first electrical socket and the second electrical socket. This is going to be a little bit complicated, so you may want to close your eyes and follow how it's going to be. So the charging connector has a first electrical socket and the second electrical socket. A first sleeve is concentrically coupled to the first electrical socket and the second sleeve is concentrically coupled to the second electrical socket. A manifold assembly encloses the first and second electrical sockets and the first and second sleeves, such that the first and second sleeves and manifold assembly create a hollow interior space there between. The manifold assembly has an inlet conduit and an outlet conduit such that inlet conduit interior space and the outlet conduit together create a fluid flow path. Cooling fluid flows through the fluid flow path and cools the charging connector. During operation, the cooling fluid bifurcates into a first fluid stream which flows around first sleeve and the second fluid stream which flows around second sleeves. The first and second fluid streams combine upstream of the outlet conduit. The first sleeve encloses first electrical socket and the second sleeve encloses second electrical socket. The cooling sleeves are made from a thermally conducting material and such that heat generated by electrical socket can be removed by the cooling fluid. In embodiment, this thermally conducting material is a thermally conductive plastic material. Therefore, this socket does, um, this is a simple idea. I was just wondering why Tesla didn't come up with this idea like years before. Simple fluid removes the heat and therefore speeds up the uh, energy transfer, speeding up charging time and decreasing the heat. Welcome back, friends. This is Armin Haryan. So what do you think about Tesla's new uh, sockets and new conduit for cooling and charging? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. How long do you think until all the superchargers have this one or have this availability connector. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla news. Ring the bell so you don't miss my coverage and let's look what I have for you. God bless you and please give us thumbs up and let's move on to our next Tesla story. The teenager who runs Twitter account tracking Elon Musk's private jet rejects the offer of free Tesla to delete it. Friends, I have avoided this topic and didn't cover it because I don't believe this is worthy because I believe people must have their privacy, but this teenager is getting too much um, uh, media attention and I wanted to say that this is not right. People should have their privacy. Now, if offering to pay this teenager money, what if another one comes up and starts 
starts another account. What if three others come up and get similar accounts? I think what Elon Musk must do or should do should go to the government re relevant agencies and say, look, I need some privacy. I don't want people to follow my jets, you know, because this is getting out of hand. Please do something about that or make some jurisdictions that can um, re respect or protect my privacy. But what's the background? A 19 year old famous for his Twitter account that tracks Elon Musk's private jet was on Friday offered a free Tesla to delete it, but he rejected the offer. Jack Sweeney had said previously that he'd take a free Tesla from Elon Musk in exchange for deleting the account, having rejected an offer of $5,000 from the Tesla CEO. On Twitter Friday, Scott Painter, CEO of Autonomy, a car hire company, offered Sweeney a subscription to a Tesla Model 3 if he deleted the Musk jet tracking account. The Wall Street Journal reported that the offer was for a three-year subscription, as you can see from the tweet. Sweeney responded, I told you I'm not interested in a subscription. Besides, there are numerous facts that suggest this is in conjunction with Elon. In an interview with the journal on Friday, Sweeney explained why he came to this decision. To be honest, I don't know if why the journal would give Sweeney an interview, you know, because like I said, this is not worth it. People must have their privacy. Don't you agree with me, friends? Let me know your thoughts. I mean, the man wants to fly from point A, point B. The whole world shouldn't follow that. But anyway, in an interview to on Friday, Sweeney explained why he came to this decision. He said, I want my own car. I don't want to have to give it back in three years, he said. If I got an actual Tesla, then I would take it down. Sweeney did not immediately respond to Insider's request for comment because the uh, Business Insider tried to reach out to him. His jet tracking account uses bots that monitor publicly available air traffic data. I mean, if this guy, 19 years old, can monitor that, Tomorrow, 50 others will be able to monitor that, right? So what are you going to do? Elon Musk uh, pay everyone for that? Now, anyway, after turning down $5,000 from Musk to delete the account, Sweeney told Insider he refused the offer because it wasn't enough to replace the satisfaction he gets from running the account. Wow, to replace the satisfaction. To, so you're running an account, just satisfying yourself, and, uh, making other people uh, to security risk. Uh, this is not correct in my opinion. Do you agree, guys? Anyway, in his initial conversation with Elon Musk, which occurred via Twitter, direct messages in fall 2021 and was first reported by Protocol, Musk said, can you take this down? It is a security risk. I mean, this man has a legit reason. This is becoming a security risk. Sweeney replied, yes, I can, but I'll, it'll cost you a Model 3 only joke, unless joking, uh, joking unless. Musk responded, how about 5,000 for this account and generally helping make it harder for crazy people to track me? Sweeney said, sounds doable, account and all my help, uh, any chance to up it to $50,000? He cited college funding and told the billionaire the money could go toward buying a Tesla Model 3. So I don't know, is this college funding or buying a Tesla or is this a something, you know, in order in exchange for security, pay me? I don't know, friends. Let me know your thoughts. What do you think? Um, do you agree? Do you believe this is right? Because tomorrow, if we build a world where everybody has to pay for their security, you know, this this may uh, this may come back and haunt any person. Anyway, this is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to this channel for daily breaking news. Ring, ring the bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. And God bless you, everyone. Give us thumbs up, please, for this story. Let, let me know your opinion in the comment section below. Let's move to our next Tesla story. See what I have for you.